Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Leanne and today I am just sharing with you a really small, quick, like fill in Aldi haul. Um, but while I was at Aldi, I was coming across some of their like special things that they were carrying for the Christmas holiday season. And so I pulled out my camera to just show you a few of those things. So I'm gonna insert that footage now and then I will show you my haul. Okay, so I didn't necessarily get any of the Christmas things, but I did get a couple of their specialty items to try. I got these Belgium cocoa dusted truffles. And honestly, these treats were mainly because they were treats that don't have like canola oil or vegetable oil or any soy product in it, which seems to be in everything. So since these items did not have that, I decided to give them a try for a treat. I got these peaches. This has like vanilla in it. Um, that's, I think that's a vanilla bean. Um, anyways, these looked really good and they had a really good ingredient list, um, in my opinion anyway. And then I decided to try these cheese crisps. This is the Melting Romano and this one is the Asiago and Cheddar. So these were kind of my impulse buys. I got five boxes of tissues, bought another loaf of bread. Not sure if what we have will get us through the rest of the week and we keep our bread in the refrigerator anyway, so it will last for sure. We needed some produce, so I got some pears. Two bags of these green grapes. Look at how beautiful these were. I was so excited. They were 89 cents a pound. These are huge, like huge green grapes. Some bananas, um, a spaghetti squash. I decided since there was only 89 cents a pound and I, I'm gonna use that for dinner probably tomorrow. I was gonna do rice cauliflower but um, that's in the freezer and that can last longer. So I decided I was gonna switch it up and do that. I got some lettuce. I always get organic, but I didn't wanna stop anywhere else. Aldi usually has organic romaine, but they did not. And I just needed some so my husband could put that on his sandwiches. So I made an exception. I do wash my produce um, really well anyway, 
but I still really do prefer to get organic with that kind of stuff, but doesn't always happen. Pepper jack cheese and some of this ham because they were out of this the last time I went. Um, we like to use this for our sandwiches, but I also like to put it in eggs or I've added it into like potato soup or whatever. So we've been getting that. This never any ham like this is actually cheaper per pound than the lunch meat stuff. So, and my husband really likes the bigger pieces. He feels like he's having a little bit heartier of a meal for his um, lunch. So anyways, I got that. I got a cream cheese because I am going to need this for a recipe. I have one in the refrigerator, but um, I'll be using that for a recipe and I wanted to have a backup because I should always have a backup of cream cheese. A dozen eggs and then four bags of frozen broccoli. So I spent about $56 on my groceries today. And, oh, and I got um, a six pack of paper towels. Forgot, those are not in here. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel and join my YouTube family. If you do, don't forget to hit the notification bell. That way you can be sure to actually know about videos because YouTube is weird, so you need to do that. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.